Kanye was like, I think it's weird. Like, we've never met his family. That's weird. If you talk sh to Kanye, he's going to put that up here and run with it. I mean, it is weird. I'm not, we saying, I'm not saying we're that all different. How about you used to be weird? We all put up with each other. Kanye West has gone completely crazy with his Instagram rants after his ex-wife Kim Kardashian broke up with her boyfriend Pete. Kanye hasn't spared anyone, not even Kim's mother. Kanye has always been a rather problematic person, especially when he gets angry and starts blasting people on his social media accounts. This time, he has crossed all limits by bringing his former mother-in-law under fire by calling her a bad influence on his children. Chris has had enough of Kanye disrespecting her and has threatened him to put an immediate stop to this madness. Kanye says the Kardashian family is forcefully keeping him out of his children's life. He finds it absolutely insane that he gets to have no say in where his children study or what they do. All the children's important decisions are based on what would be more marketable and profitable. Kanye alleged that companies like Hulu and Calabasas were deciding where his kids go to school. Kanye has made it clear that Chris has started using her grandchildren to make money, just like her kids, and that he is not okay with this. In an Instagram post, Kanye said his kids wouldn't go to Sierra Canyon, but to his Christian school Donda. In the end, he even asked his fans to grab some popcorn, making it abundantly clear that he had no intentions of backing off or stopping this drama anytime soon. He's even worried if the kids stay under their grandmother's influence, they'll end up in Playboy magazines. Chris was not going to stay silent over Kanye slandering her like this. Like any reasonable person, she tried solving this issue privately by messaging Kanye and asking him, can you please stop? He even asked her if she thinks she has a say in these important life decisions for his black kids because she is half white. This was at the end of the nightmare for Kris Jenner. She tried to stop Kanye from this public meltdown once again. In another private message that Kanye later decided to blast on Instagram, Chris is seen begging Kanye to stop as she is 67 years old and doesn't always feel great. This bizarre behavior by the rapper stressed out Chris to the point she had to request him to put a stop to it. At this point, we're all wondering why Kris Jenner hasn't already sued Kanye for distressing her and her family by sharing private conversations and leaking their secrets. But she won't be silent for long. This time, Chris is threatening him to take legal action if the behavior continues. But I think what I really want to do is be there to help him and be the best version of himself that he can be. And he knows that we're there if he needs us. Chris has always been very patient with Kanye. She has always said that she tries to be there to help him be the best version of himself. Unfortunately, it seems like Chris is now running out of patience, and very soon, this lava is going to explode. If there's anything you need to know about Kris Jenner, it's that you're better off not being in her bad books. Fans think Kanye is justified in being worried about his children and their future. One tweeted that the Kardashians made a fortune selling out women. The mom, Kris, charged her kids a fee for being their momager. Now Kanye is feuding with them, worried his two daughters will end up in Playboy. Can't really blame the man. That's it from our side for today, folks. Until next time, bye!